Welcome to the Donato for Data Analytics course. My name is Katie and I'll be your instructor for this course, where we will learn about using Donato for data analytics, which is at the forefront of business decision making. As you can see here in the agenda, I'll give you an overview of all the modules we are going to learn in this course. We will start with an overview of using data virtualization and data analytics, and then see various data analytics steps and the role of Donato in each step. And finally, we will show how the complexities of machine learning can be minimized with the help of data virtualization. The main goal of this course is to help data scientists and students understand the significance of using data virtualization in the data analytics process. In the data analytics and data virtualization module, students will see how Donoto adds value to data analytics through its virtual layer. They will also learn the steps needed to achieve successful data analytics, understand the various challenges involved in quickly yielding actionable insights, and see how data virtualization helps overcome the challenges. The data analytics process maps out six steps to achieve a successful outcome. It can be easily accomplished with the help of Donato's data virtualization capabilities. In this data collection module, Students will get a brief introduction to data collection and how Donato Platform helps scientists get all the information needed for their analysis. It will also provide insight into how data discovery can be achieved by making use of the Donato Data Catalog, which allows for searching and browsing the right data. Finally, they will see how additional data set requirements can be built by using the Donato Platform. Datasets will be suitable for analysis only after going through some of the preparation techniques, which can vary. In this data preparation module, you will learn about data preparation and its techniques to prepare the collected raw data sets for effective data analysis. You will also get to know about the analytical functions available in Donato, which you can use for preparing the data sets. While analyzing big data sets, Visualization plays a major role in showing the datasets graphically. In this data visualization module, we will learn in detail how data can be visualized with the help of different techniques, and then how to choose the right visualization for the appropriate datasets. There is a new tool included in Denoto Platform 8 called Apache Zeppelin for Denoto, which also helps in performing data analytics. It leverages the power of various interpreters, like Python, to create advanced charts. In the Apache Zeppelin Notebook for Denoto module, you will learn about querying Denoto from Zeppelin Notebook for data analytics, see details about installation and configuration of the Apache Zeppelin for Denoto tool, and finally, understand how to query and create visualizations in it. Use of third-party visualization tools, such as Power BI, Tableau, and Jupyter Notebook, also helps for creating a high level of visualizations. In the module, Other Third-Party Tools for Analytics, you will get an overview of how other third-party visualization tools can be connected to Denoto for data analytics, and also about the importance of Denoto when compared to the federated capabilities of other tools. In the final module, Machine Learning, you will learn on a high level about machine learning, how the complexities of machine learning can be minimized with the help of data virtualization, and how to interpret the analysis with the help of machine learning algorithms in the Apache Zeppelin for Denoto tool for making better business decisions. As a final summary, in this course, we have learned about the importance of Denoto in the data analytics process applying data analytics techniques using Denoto, and how to yield better analyses to make informed business decisions.